So on a Saturday afternoon, Armand sent M text messages each hour for five hours, and Tyrone sent P text messages each hour for four hours. We want to know which of the following represents the total number of messages sent by Armand and Tyrone on Saturday afternoon. So we have the choices 9 multiplied by M multiplied by P, 20 multiplied by M multiplied by P, 5M plus 4P, and then 4M plus 5P. So, you know, you could probably, you know, maybe you can reason this one out without, um, you know, even, even using some real numbers. But let's suppose that Armand, just for, to give some concrete numbers, Suppose Armand sent, um, suppose he sent three text messages each hour. Well, he did that for five hours total, so he sent three plus another three plus another three plus another three plus another three for a total of 15 messages. Well, the way that we got that is we would say, again, if he sent three messages, he sent three messages multiplied by five hours. So three multiplied by five is going to give us 15. Okay, so again, instead of three though, that was our the value we used for m. So we would have m multiplied by five, or five m message, messages total sent by Armand. So Armand sent five multiplied by m messages. And the same reasoning, Tyrone sent P messages for four hours. So Tyrone sent P messages for four hours. So that means he, we would take four and multiply that by P to get the number of messages that Tyrone sent. So the total, in this case, we would just add those two values together. We would have 5M plus 4P. And those are not like terms because we have the variable M and we have the variable P. Um, so we can't combine that any further, but that would be our solution in this case. So it looks like answer choice C here would be the correct choice.